AIT barred from covering President Muhammad Buhari. The management of the African Independent Television, AIT, has accused the federal government of blocking its crew from covering the 2020 to 2025 broadband plan for President Muhammad Buhari. The event took place on Monday in Abuja. According to AIT, its crew who got to the venue early enough ahead of Mr. Buhari's arrival were told by a deputy director in the Nigerian Communication and Community Commission, NCC, that AIT has been restricted from covering the event. AIT, in a post on its website, said why other television stations were allowed in. Its crew were denied their right of informing the public of the news value content of the events. Since the current administration assured office in 2015, AIT has provided consistent coverage of activities of the National Communication Commission, NCC, and the Ministry of Communication and Digital Economy without any misunderstanding or complaints. The official in the NCC who told the crew to leave has also had a good working relationship with the broadcaster and conveyed the directive with apologies saying he was merely following instructions. No reasons was given for the action taken against AIT, apart from the statement that it was a directive from above. Thank you for listening to this news. Viewers, I will start by by, uh, touching on the last statement from the last person. Nigeria has no problem in uh, in who and how uh, is uh, affected or not. AIT, I would say that uh, should not bother themselves so much about this uh, sudden decision, you know, of President Mohammed Buhari. You see, even if other con- other um, broadcasting stations were given this opportunity and they were not, they should not give themselves too much worries because even the person they are uh, trying or striving to cover so i would say that doesn't worth it because at the end of the day what they will end up getting as a coverage will be a disappointment no solid information or solid points will be gotten from the video you know sometimes it baffles me the way we talk in this country we have forgotten so soon how TVC TVC two was reporting their their own uh, their their own uh, news consigning a great personality as well, but then uh, as a result of that, they too receive the 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 unsudden ban. You see, one thing about Nigerian government is the moment they see that you are the, the any broadcasting station is coming close to close to getting them exposed immediately before they start discussing about it they will just do something about by making sure that uh, their station doesn't receive any ban so i would say that ait should just remain calm they pre- yes pretend to have accepted the correction but them is good 
Okay? It's good. And again, be focused and remain absolute. Don't be distracted by what's most, what must have been said by uh, a viewer. Is that you should be motivated and given that confidence to go on. You see, um, President Mulberry doesn't want or deserve what's ever uh, question that will be um, issued or uh, asked to President Mulberry because I know that even um, give him the opportunity to be covered and ask one or two questions, you will see that uh, you, you see that nothing of great uh, importance will be able to to be gotten. You know, so uh, Nigerians should uh, should just back on and rely and be focused on the day the day that the Biafrans will be announced and granted freedom instead of spending their too many time and paying attention to things that we I personally know we bring the cause of setbacks and backwardness in this great uh, uh, channel. So um, I would say that uh, Nigerians has not done wrong in um, giving Optromole another opportunity. And to me, I would say that the opportunity should be given, should be given um, a maximum uh, support and adherence. You know, it, it was as a result of I've been able to adhere to the uh, to the decisions and mistakes made by this uh, by our Nigerians, you know. So we should not allow ourselves to be deceived or pushed to the wall any longer. A spade is a spade, and let's call it a spade. So Nigerians. I am speaking not because I enjoy speaking. I am speaking because I know that one of your very good opportunity and what you've been praying for is how to get yourself off this deal and get focused on how to affect lives through information. You see, there are so many things that you can you can benefit just only striking and watching you know people will be looking at the advantage from the size but the fact is not still far fetched the size i paid for was just the 1000 aspect of it so looking at uh whatsoever the uh the government must have said concerning this i will say that it should better be positive because um i know nigeria nigeria as a country uh they are fond of of uh, giving fake and uh on head of advice so uh they should just uh keep calm and be watching pending when they have decided to call them up again and also i know what is going to cost them to remain on air not, not to remain on air okay but that should not affect us that much because i know definitely there was going to be a solution to that so uh meanwhile i will still urge the uh the people of uh of of a uh, APC, okay, not to uh, not to be allowed to be dribbled or pushed to the wall so much by the president. Yes, I know he has done well. He has done well by making sure that no that that Nigeria are are, are not being fair to the to the national leader 
So with his human respect, he made a positive move and made sure that uh, Oshomole is reinstated back on his seat. Yes, there may be a large crowd and a large turnout, but then the truth is that the truth is that Masi Inawekano is is very much um, interested, you know, in this case. No one that we hear this and we say that uh, he's not interested or won't develop interest in it, you know, because that has so much affected so many Nigerians. So that's it. So uh, what's your own comment concerning this news? Please don't forget to leave it behind. Click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to receive more updates. Thank you.